I think it's important now that he's just going to enjoy his life with the family because F1 is such a short period of time in your life that you work so hard to achieve all these things he has achieved and now it's time to enjoy. It goes without saying that Verstappen is a generational talent and God knows how many titles he's going to win with this type of car and his driving style. However, all things must come to an end and although we're very, very far away from seeing Verstappen drive his last race, the end could be a lot sooner than everybody anticipates. Max Verstappen has spoke about the period of his life that's called retirement, shocking his fans as to what age he thinks is appropriate to hang his helmet in the garage and call it quit. So, what did Verstappen have to say about the retirement plans? Stick around with us to find out more. Now, after what many perceive to be a very controversial finish in Suzuka, Verstappen has won his second championship at the age of 25. To be frankly honest, there wasn't anything controversial about that finish if you look at the rules, but the fact that the FIA had to over-explain itself yet again when it comes to Verstappen's championship is enough for the haters and the foul mouths to bring hell to Verstappen's head. He absolutely deserved the 2022 championship, outperforming every single car out there and finishing races by starting P4 P10 and P7. Nevertheless, Verstappen was asked about his possible retirement plans, and although it's very early in his career to think about that, the Dutchman shared some thoughts as to when he thinks is the perfect time to call it quits. Max Verstappen said that he doesn't want to be in F1 after the 35th year of his life, saying that he's not in F1 to secure a number of championships, something that his rival Hamilton has his eyes set on. The Briton was very close to securing the eighth record-breaking championship last year, but the fact that the race ended the way it did saw him lose it on the last lap at the very last race of the 2021 season. However, after being absent from social media for a couple of months, Hamilton has posted a picture on Twitter saying I'm back, referring to the quest for the 8th championship. Now according to Verstappen, this isn't something that he's going to chase in his life, if the circumstances are going to bring that upon his career. When talking to Channel 4, Verstappen said, it's not about the number of championships or whatever, it's also a quality of life. We're going to more races. I have a contract until 2028 and I'll be 31, so I do think about if we're heading into this direction with more and more races, do I really want to continue this until I'm 35? Probably not, because there's so many more fun things as well I want to do outside of Formula 1 and I don't want to be travelling almost my whole year being away from family and friends. So I see myself doing this for a few more years and of course definitely till the end of the contract but then I'll definitely make my mind up if I really want to continue to live this lifestyle because it's very demanding. I like to be at home. I really love being at home and being away so much it's sometimes a bit painful, said Verstappen. On the other hand, you have Lewis Hamilton. The seven-time world champion has mentioned multiple times throughout the 2022 season that he'll likely stay in the sport for a couple of more years until he has a legitimate chance of winning the record-breaking eighth championship in his career. Seems like the last lap in Abu Dhabi has left some serious marks in Hamilton's confidence, but on the other hand, Hamilton is now more motivated than ever to win yet another championship in his career. Although the Briton said that he doesn't want to be racing in his 40s and there are many more interesting things to do in this period of his life, seems like like he's going to continue the path that Alonso created and that is to race well after his 40s. Alonso is currently 41 years old and signed a deal with Aston Martin for three more years, meaning that he'll likely be here until his 45th year of his life. Toto Wolff shares some insights about Hamilton and his future career, saying that in a talk with the Briton, the seven-time world champion said that he has at least five years left in the tank, which means that he'll likely be present in the sport for a long time to come. The advantage is we speak a lot together. Just last week we sat down and he says, look, I have another five years in me, how do you see that? Over time we have just grown together, we're totally transparent with each other. Lewis will be the first one to say, I can't do this anymore because I feel I haven't got the reactions anymore or I've just lost fun doing it and there is another generation growing up that is just very strong, said Wolf. Now it's evident that Verstappen and Hamilton are two very different personalities, both on and off the track. Hamilton had a chance to provide us with further updates as to what his future holds and when talking about his well-being and his continuous push in F1, he said, For me, I feel healthier than I've ever felt. I'm feeling fit, I love what I'm doing and I don't plan on stopping anytime soon. My goal is always to be with Mercedes. I signed with them in 1997. I love that we have the long partnership we have. I feel like we're embarking on a lot of really positive things, not only in the sport but outside, and I think there's a lot to accomplish together, and I want to be a part of that. 
But what are some similarities between these two drivers? Well, for example, Hamilton had the same vision as Verstappen when he was at his age, and we record him saying that he was unlikely to be racing past his 30th year of life. Fast forward to today, and Hamilton stresses how he won't leave any time soon, and that he plans on bringing Mercedes back to its glory. And with that being said, do you believe that Verstappen will likely leave the F1 sport after his 35th year of life? Let us know in the comments below.